HMS Illustria just inching her way through the dock, the sister ship of uh, the Invincible behind us. Well, there's the scores, seven points each, absolutely level. Now we turn our attention to the cycling. Now, it's 200 metres up, a tight 180 degree turn that caused a lot of problems last week. 200 metres back, three men and one woman from each team. And I must say, the riders team looks just about invincible on bikes. Good, good points here, surely. I, I would have thought we will get a full house. We don't know, I should be very disappointed. First of all, hope. Got to be. We'll get a full house. <laughs> Well, yes, it really should be a question. Can any of those white shirts of the ball sports team get in amongst the black shirts of the riders? The riders, of course, all top cyclists. The lineup: Anne Hobbs from tennis nearest us, then Andy Ruffle, the BMX trick cyclist, Ian Taylor, the Olympic hockey goalkeeper, Catherine Swinnerton, the Olympic road racer, Sean Curley, that's the Olympic hockey goal scorer, then Malcolm Elliott, the professional circuit champion, really on home ground for him, Graham Gooch, the cricketer, the man with the yellow stripe on the top of his helmet, and then right at the far side, little Steve Yockin, the British road race champions so the bikies all for them right on home ground are you ready the ball sports what a job stand by and watch out for the black shirts out they go out in front my goodness there's an event in uh, all the semi-finals of the super teams which suits one team and this really should be a formality unless they go wrong on the turn all the shirts up there malcolm elliott steve jockin Catherine Swinnerton even there as well, and Andy Ruffle. Malcolm Elliott in second place at the moment, taking it pretty easy. And even Catherine Swinnerton, the girl in the team, the Olympic road racer, she's up there as well. And uh, that's Anne Hobbs looking a little worried about it all. She doesn't play tennis on a bike. And they're just going to stream through here. They're going to be first, second, third, and fourth. They really had to be. And they wouldn't have lived to tell the tale if they hadn't. So maximum points for the riders with the four cyclists in the team. I'm afraid the ball sports quartet had to be runners up. Listen, when, yeah. when you three cross the line, you had big smiles on your faces. What was that like? Yeah, well, I've been practicing riding a bike for a couple of days and uh, <laughs> <laughs> it helped me out a bit today. Yeah. <laughs> Raised morale all round, didn't it? <laughs> In your own element and looking good. Hey, well done.